Hey guys, um, my name's Emma and I'm filling in for Martine for the next three weeks on Queer Factor. Um, and I hope I can do the channel some justice and not make really bad videos, but um, I'll try my hardest. I first met Martine uh, a couple months ago um, when I drove past her house on a tractor. I've done it quite a few times and she seems to shout at me like every time but one one day I decided to shout back and we eventually got into a conversation about boats and grass so not the drug grass but like grass grass like that colour like is a thing yeah that's like grass and that's like the sky kind of like my dress kind of like that actually I don't know I kind of like the colour of blue and green but yeah um so I've known Martine for Two, two or three months now and I have lots of tractors and I like to annoy her by driving past her house but yeah my name's Emma and um, I'll be here for the next three well next two next three weeks this is my first video we won next Wednesday and then we won after that and then the week Wednesday after that you'll be back to Martine <laughs> so this week on Queer Factor we are talking about fashion and style um, so I'm not going to talk about Martine's fashion and style because that would be silly but I'm going to talk about my style I'm actually part of a travelling circus travel all over um, my town not really not really in the world scale yet but I'm sure we'll get there at some point but this, this is actually my natural hair natural hair natural hair um, the hair you just saw before that's actually a wig not this one this is my natural hair it's really curly but I just I dye it with food colouring. This is actually this is a nice dress that I made. I made it today um, using some masking tape. That's that's why I'm also I work in the side apart from the travelling circus. I work I work work work. I work in um, fashion and textiles and my dress is falling apart. That just shows you how unreliable um, masking tape is. I mean it's good, probably not for like making dresses and stuff. Now I know for certain that I'm a very fashionable person, like as you can see from what I'm wearing, this is a lovely like 60s tie around my head and you know, I, I like to stand out from the crowd and you know, if you're wearing like this, it's bright, so I mean, you're not going to really blend in with like the majority of people in the world. I mean, maybe builders and stuff, but like walking around town, around the city, there's not that many builders in like bright yellow jacket things, especially not in the middle of summer when it's like 30 degrees, but um, yeah, basically, I, I wear this all year round. I wear it, like, most days. Um, yeah, it's really nice. Like, I mean, sometimes it gets a bit warm and I get some weird looks, but I like to stand out from the crowd, like I said, so it doesn't really bother me. Because, you know, people are paying attention to me because I'm all like this. And I also I wear my rubber gloves. Rubber gloves. My rubber gloves. I wear my rubber gloves. Also known as rubber gloves. I wear them around as well. So, that, you know, you can just imagine me walking down the street like this. And, you know, you know, you know, you're going to pay me some attention, which is why I wear this, because, you know, I like, um, I like standing out from the crowd a little bit, and the tie, it just, it just adds a whole, 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 it adds a whole, yes, let's look to the slacks, no, it adds a whole more, whole, I can't say that word, it's not something that I'd say, but, yeah, it just adds, like, a whole more level of coolness to you, and also, I mean, you could add a quiff, like, I'm not really quiffed up right now, but, you can add a quiff to your air, and then you have like that, and you're just walking down the street. Like sometimes you can even be like, why am I seeing? I know that wasn't a real tune, but you know, if you do that, people are obviously going to look at you and pay you some attention. And obviously it's going to be good, because I mean, if you look like this, you can't exactly get bad attention. It's just, you're just going to look cool, you know? And this one, this is fantastic. I mean, I know like not a lot of people would think it, it's really like, I mean, you wouldn't like think of walking down the street wearing a bin bag. But it's actually it's not as bad as people think it is because you know that like, you can just style it in all the different ways. You can open it whenever you want. You can put arms in like up there, put it down there. You can't have any arm like bits at all. And you know it just it works. You can just do it anyway, and you can just it just works. You know you can style your hair whatever way and like see that I've just like that I've just been dragged through a hedge backwards style. You know that really really goes with this look. Like okay, it's totally not even working right now. But if you get lots of hairspray and do like mess it up, especially if you know if you use some wax as well, like this, like you know, it just works. You're walking down the street, 
it's not like wide, wide shoulders, you know, and you're walking down the street, you know, you feel like a model or something, you know, and it just, it really works. I'm, pr I'm sure you want to like, I'm actually starting to bake like a baked potato right now. It looks fabulous and it feels fabulous and people are going to think you're absolutely fabulous, so why not? Why not just wear it? You know, you can even become a fashion designer, people walking down the street, you know, like Vivian Westwood just like strolling down, like Alexander McQueen or something. And you know, they just see you and they're like, oh, that, she is onto something. Then they hire you and you can become like a famous fashion designer and like, maybe you don't want to become a fashion designer, but get rich. And I mean, rich, to be rich and famous is all anybody wants. Okay, so I'm not actually as crazy as you may have thought that would have been. Um, and you may have noticed that my voice slash accent has changed. But um, yeah, my name's not Emma and I'm not from England and... I did not meet Martine by driving a tractor past her heads. <laughs> my name's Lindsay and I'm from Scotland. So some of you might know me as Lindsay, um, some of you might not know me at all, and some of you might know me as 10, thing, 10 Things Queer from YouTube. Yeah, I'm here to fill in for, my hair looks really rude. Like my hair, okay, really rude, it's, it needs cut because it's just a mess. Um, and probably like the being dragged out a hedge backwards thing didn't really this is not, not in my favour. Anyway, like I was saying, I use hand gestures way too much. But yeah, I'm from Scotland, my name's Lindsay, or 10 Things Queer from YouTube if you want to go see more of my videos that usually aren't as weird as this, but some are, and I'll put a link. But um, yeah, I'm, anyway, I'm here to fill in for Martine for the next three Wednesdays. Can't remember what I was going to say. But yeah, I don't dress like that all the time. Just some, yeah, no, I don't really dress like that. But um, to what I do dress like, I don't really have a particular style or um, like anything really. Some days I dress like in dresses because dresses are fun. But you know, you rarely see me in a dress, but that's because I think I look weird in a dress. I never really got out in a dress, but dresses are fun. So sometimes I wear dresses. Um and sometimes I wear more boyish or androgynous clothes, such as shirts and ties. And sometimes I wear this top or tops like this top, which I can't find right now because my clothes are like all over the place and different towns and everything. It's yeah. Anyway, this tops is Vegasaurus and it has a dinosaur with, with leaves in it. No, um, because I was about to say because I'm a vegetable. No, because I'm a vegetarian. Um, and it's, it's cute. So yeah, sometimes I wear this top. I like shirts a lot, like this one. Um, and I have like a lot. I used to wear that. That was like all I used to wear. This is the only one I can find. The kind of like three of my friends have three different shirts. And one of them has two of my shirts. I just can't find the rest of them. So yeah, I like to wear shirts. Like this. Um, I like scarves sometimes. I know it's like summer, but I really like this scarf. I don't really like last week. And I like it. Um, and I like this jacket, which I also bought the other day. The same day as I bought the scarf. But yeah, um, it's like a grey leather jacket, but not real leather because cows are cute and I don't really want to wear their skin so yeah it's like PVC I guess or something like that but yeah I really like it. it has a bit for your phone so you just like really really cool I mean I'm burning off and I'm like pass out because it's so warm and I'm wearing like a leather jacket type thing and a scarf and on to the last thing which is actually sorry like the last two things but we'll just see the last thing because yeah I talk far too long. I mean, I have to edit this video down because it's probably like a half an hour or something. Yeah, skinny jeans are pretty much all out of wear, like all the time. Except in really, really hot weather when it's shorts or something. But yeah, I wear jeans and skinny jeans a lot. Um, and shoes. I have shoes here, but not all my shoes. I can't find all my shoes. Are really, really, really bad right now. They're like fun shoes, but they have a thing. Um, yeah, it's too warm to wear, no? But anyway, um. I'm gonna go because I've talked for a very long time and I have to try and edit this down until about seven minutes. It's probably not gonna happen. Um, so anyway, this is my first video for Pure Factor filling in for Martine on Wednesday. So you'll see me next Wednesday and the Wednesday after that. And if you want to check out my videos on my personal channel, um, I'll put a link in the bar. Um, ow, and I'm gonna go. I'm standing in a wire and it hurts. Um, yeah, I'm really warm now just because it was warm out and because I just tried on like lots of clothes. But yeah. Anyway, I'm going to go and um, yeah, I'll see you guys next week on Crew Factor on Wednesday. Bye!